Well, following a day of snow, wind and slush, snow removal crews are getting to work reopening roads across Kelloland. Tonight, Tyler Louder takes us through the Rapid City area to show you how they're improving those conditions. Rapid City Street team has been preparing for the arrival of this snow and working on a brining operation. These drivers take their time to make sure roads get cleared in the right order and ask people to avoid parking on the street until crews have been by. We kind of prefer if we can have a little more open space. It, it definitely helps us, helps us out, but it's not a, you know, it's not dire that if you don't do it, we're not going to be too, too upset about it. you got to park someplace and you got to travel, so we don't get too upset about it. If cars are parked on the road, the trucks will make sure to get as much of the streets cleared as they can. The Street Division team here in Rapid City has been working all throughout the night, starting last night on Christmas Day to get these streets cleared. And what they do is they'll hit the main lines first, followed through with collection areas, and then they'll hit up the residential. Jeremy Cahill says the roads are the easy part, but if issues line up with their vehicles, it can cause delays. Our big worry is that uh, uh, car truck accidents because what happens is our operators sometimes will have to do uh, uh, on some ongoing testing because of uh, federal laws and depending on how serious the truck is damaged it can be months before we can get a truck repaired sometimes. Thankfully everything is working at 100 percent and the street division team has roads cleared for drivers. In Rapid City, Tyler Lauder, Killaland News. And the street department wants to remind drivers new to the snow to drive with caution and be prepared for longer drive times until conditions improve.